happened to me in heaven, amen, and in earth. All power is given unto me in heaven and in earth. And we know this is Jesus speaking to the 11 disciples after he had, amen, been crucified. He had told them to meet him, amen, in Galilee, amen, in a mountain at an appointed time, hallelujah. And he disclosed to them, hallelujah, I have laid down my life, I have died, and I have, hallelujah, glory be to God, finished my course. I have done what I've came to this earth to do. And all power has been given unto me, hallelujah, in heaven, amen, as well as on this earth. Glory be to God. And he commissioned them and let them know, hallelujah, you got that same power. Praise be to God. Hallelujah. These works and greatest shall they do. But you cannot, hallelujah, have this power until there be a death. You have to die to sin. So many want the manifestation of God in their lives. Hallelujah. So many want the anointing of God to operate in their life. So many, hallelujah, glory be to God. Hallelujah, glory be to God. Want to do these works and greater, but they don't want to die to this world. Amen. If you want to be used by God, there's got to be a death. Hallelujah. Just like Jesus died. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That he may obtain, amen, the things of God. You and I must die. We have to die to sin. We have to die to self. Hallelujah. We have to die. Glory be to God. We have to die die to this world. Hallelujah. My God from on high. So many want to operate, amen, in the spirit of God, but you cannot operate in the spirit of God if you have not died, amen, to your flesh. If you have not crucified your members on earth, he says that we have to be, hallelujah, born again. Nicodemus came to Jesus by night and said, what must I do to inherit the kingdom of God? Jesus said, you must be born again of the water and of the spirit. And God is saying to you and I today, hallelujah, if you want, hallelujah, the power of God to be manifested in your life, you must be born again. You have to die, hallelujah. You have to die, hallelujah. You have to die to your way of thinking. You have to die to your way of living. You have to die to your way of operating. Praise be to God. We have to be, hallelujah, born again of the water and of the spirit of God. Hallelujah, glory be to God. So that the spirit of God can operate inside of you. So the spirit Spirit of God can move inside of you. So the Spirit of God can lead and guide you into all truths. Hallelujah. You have to die. He says, hallelujah, his ways are not our ways, nor his thoughts our thoughts. As far as the heaven is from the earth, so is his ways from our ways. God is saying today that you got to die. Amen. And the way we die, amen, is get in the face of God. We die by crucifying our members on earth. Hallelujah. By the Spirit of God, by the will of God, by the word of God, hallelujah, my God, he said, hallelujah, all power is given unto me in heaven and in earth, God wants to give you that same power, God wants to, give, he wants to give you that same power, hallelujah, glory be to God, that you can walk right, that you can talk right, that you can be used by God, that you can lay your hands on the sick and they shall recover, that you can prophesy, hallelujah, you can foretell the things of God. Hallelujah. You can speak life into that dying soul. Hallelujah. You can speak to dry bones. Hallelujah. And flesh shall come upon their body. God says, hallelujah, glory be to God. But then all for you, in order for me to use you, glory be to God, there has to be a death. Just like Jesus died. Hallelujah. We have to die as well. Hallelujah. The Bible says it is important unto man once to die. And after that, amen, it is the rest resurrection. I died one time. I don't have to die no more. Praise be to God. We high up. Hey, hey, I died one time. I don't have to die no more. God said, hallelujah, glory be to God. Your power. Amen. Your strength. Hallelujah, you are anointing all lies in. You die into this flesh. Die into